been quite a few years now since the song Adar Abba was written. The words of Adar Abba are Shanira Kolecha des Malas Chavereinu Veloiches Reinam. Well, Rabbi Lemelech Vlizensk taught us that we have to see the goodness in our brothers and sisters and look away from anything that's not the goodness. There was a Talmud of a Talmud, his name was the Deferes Shloimer, wrote the exact same idea in the Pasuk where Yaakov Avinu tells Yosef, Lech Nora Eis Shloim Achechoi, that when he sent him out to go visit his brothers, he says, Ashleimis Shlachecho Tire Val Tabit Bechestroinam. What that means is he told Yosef, he says, I hear from you, I mean, that I'm paraphrasing, of course. A lot of times you're telling me things that you saw the brothers do this, do that. You should really see the good in your brothers. You should see the perfection in your brothers. When Yosef Atzalik was faced with this big Nisayin in Mitzrayim, which was the most difficult place for a Yid to be in in those times, it says that he remembered the Yukna Shalaviv. And I'm like wondering, the Yukna Shalaviv, if a person has a Nisayin and suddenly he sees a picture of Yaakov Avinu, it wouldn't be hard to be Oymid bin Nisayin. I think the concept was the Yukonai Shalav meant he remembered what the last few words that his father had told him was Re'enos Shleim Achecha, use your eyes for seeing Shleimus and goodness in other people. This may well have been the Segula that Yaakov Avinu gave us for Shmir Senaim. We all know it's a problem, we all are aware that it's a challenge that we go through life with, but what can we really do actively? Where's the Asei Toiv? The Asei Toiv is go look, go find another Yid and say, look at that. Ach, a Yid, a Yid with a heart, a Yid was perfect. Every Yid is perfect. If I'm going to use my eyes to see the goodness in others, that's going to help me. That's Midah Kanegid Midah. You know, everything we know, it's all Midah Kanegid Midah. That will help us with Shmir Sanaim. Think about that for a minute. What could a Yetzirah throw against a Yid who's constantly looking out to find something goodness in another Yid? And this will ultimately bring us to the Gula Shleimah. We know that the Gula Shleimah is Ke'ish Echad Belev Echad. And that this happens as a result of seeing the goodness in one another. <laughs>